today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. I am a cruelty free YouTuber that is trying to have a year long no buy. And today I am doing one of my favorite things to do. I'm doing an orange look and I'm going to use this. This is the orange sorbet from BH Cosmetics, the sweet shop collection. This is like an orange lover's dream when it comes to eyeshadow. So yeah, I'm just I'm going to get started because the clock is so much later than I wanted it to be, but that's what it is. So I'm going to do an orange look. I love orange eyeshadow. It's one of the best things I know because it really, it goes really good with my eyes color but the color of my eyes because I have blue eyes blueish eyes so yeah <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking about this but I think we just hop into this so I just think I want to do like the simplest look and take these two in my crease I'm going to start with this and deepen down with this one and then I think I might go in with Maybe I'll do this on my lid. We will see, but I will start with this pinkish orange, pinkish orange, yellowy orange, and then take this more orange orange to deepen down my little crease. I don't know, like, do I have any good crease brushes? These Sweet Shop palettes, when they came out, People were like crazy about them and this was the first palette that I tried from BH and I do really love these. It wasn't that long ago since I did a look with the, the bubblegum palette. I can leave it up here. But I do not use this palette as much as I should. And I don't know why because I do like these more like the than the monochromatic palettes I have from Colourpop so I guess I just should use this more and I don't know if you have noticed anything new but I have bought a new light I've bought a super big ring light and this is the first video that I am using it and it feels like my ah uh, my face look a little bit I don't know N not like myself but I don't know but it maybe look good I did test film a little bit just to see how it looked and it looked good I think but yeah that this is a little testing video with my new lighting but I do like if this works for me I would love this so much more I've had a super small ring light and a softbox and like this LED panel um, but now I just have one super big ring light and it's so much easier for me because this I can have like this doesn't take up that much space and uh, I think I just need to find things to make it easy for me when I'm going to film so I actually <laughs> do film Please let me know if you like to, I don't know, but it feels like I'm looking maybe a little bit like this. I don't know. I haven't figured this out completely yet, but I think it looks kind of good, I hope. I don't know, it's really dark behind me, but that's just how it's going to be. So now I'm going in with Cest, because I think this will turn out a little bit more red than I want it because I do really want it orange orange so I will take this cyst just deepen down my crease a little bit have it a little bit more orange and also one of my I have only used one of my soft boxes and that is like 
it's so old <laughs> so it is starting to fall apart so I do really hope that I can make this work because I think I would like this more this orange is just such a nice orange and yeah I know that like this thing that yeah orange makes blue eyes really pop and I think they do but if you don't have blue eyes and you want to do an orange look just do it but now it just happens to be that I do really like orange and I think I would have done it even though I didn't have blue eyes. It's now that I don't know. Because I think I want to take this shimmer. Maybe I should swatch it. I don't know. Oh, Ma. Do you see this? Maybe. Okay. I know what I want to do. I'm going to start with the orange I have in my crease. And take it. A little bit out here on my lid. This, I have a new eyeshadow primer. I have the Tone Activator from Kaleidos. I don't really know what I think about it. It feels like it's changing the... Um, tone of my eyeshadow but I don't know but this is what I have to work with until it's finished and over I have some other eyeshadow primers that I bought a while back that I haven't opened yet so maybe if I don't get this to work the way I want to Maybe I should just open a new one Because it feels like it changed like the color of the eyeshadow Maybe it's just me I don't know Okay, I took this orange on so much more space and a foot on my eye lid but it is what it is right now so I will take a better brush um, I'm going in with citron citron Th this is lemon in Swedish it's citron and I want to say citron but it's citron citron citrus citron I want to take this on the rest of my lid and oh my lord this this shimmer is such a nice shimmer so it's a little bit gold or it's a lot of gold in it it's like it also a little bit orange gold and like a hint of pink I don't know but I do really really love it and it feels like I want to speed this video up a little bit I have watched or I watched I have edited some videos the latest days and oh my god I can talk so it feels like I want to speed this up okay I'm in love with these lids this is exactly what I wanted to have something super orange and just super shimmery and I just do 
love this. So I'm going to take away the four loves. I have a lot. Fix my base. And I wish now that I had an orange blush. But that is actually one thing I don't owe. Or maybe do I have a liquid? I think I do have an orange blush. Um, yeah, so I'm going to fix my base and then I come back. So this is the finished look. I actually do have an orange blush. I have this one from NYX. This is the Sweet Cheeks in Almost Famous. I don't know though. Me and the... This is not liquid blush. This is more like a mousse. We're maybe not the best friends. I did use my contour stick from Isadora. And if for my highlighter I took Ray Rider, that is a little bit of an orange hint from Kaleidos. And on my lips I took Terra, also from Kaleidos, one of their lip clays. And on my wash line I did take this one from Colourpop, that's, that is Unt, I guess, yes, it's Unt. And I do really, really love this eyeshadow. The lips, I don't know, maybe I should have gone with something else. Maybe I sh actually should have taken a red one. Should I maybe just switch it? Okay, well, this was better, so this is replied from Lethal. And I do love this eyeshadow. I did use three shades, so I'd use these three shades. And I don't know why I don't use this palette. I don't know why I don't do orange look that often because this it looks really good. I do really love how I look in orange. So yeah, I hope <laughs> I hope that you've liked this video. I know I look really really pale, like paler that I'm than I'm usually is. Um I hope that the lighting works. I will see when I edit if it looks a little bit off or not, and uh, maybe I change it to next video. But yeah, I do really love that you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope that I will see you in the next one. Bye!